Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we are talking about Eamon Zahabi versus Pedro Munoz. A I'm in Eamon Zahabi, 11-2, 4-1 in his last five fights. That one loss is Ricardo, oh, I guess not Ricardo Ramos. Vince Morales, a plus 110, basically a pick 36 years old, 5'8", with a 68 and a half inch reach. Fighting Pedro Munoz, who's 20-9, 1-3, 1-3, 0-1 in his last five fights. Minus 135, favorite, 38 years old as two years older, 5'6", with a 65 inch reach, 2 inch in height for Zahabi, with a 3 and a half inch reach advantage for also Zahabi. <sighs> this one's tough, because... I, I think Pedro Munoz is so good. I don't th I think he's better than what these this last five results are really are. He had a big win over Chris Gutierrez, kind of turned back the clock a little bit. Lost against Marlon Vieira, Marlon Vera, which I actually thought he won that fight, close fight, but I thought he won. And then Kyler Phillips kind of just pieced him up. He was able to use his distance, use his kicks a lot, keep him at bay. Did a really good job with that, but. The problem and the thing that I don't like seeing in this in it, it, recently with Munoz and going into this matchup is Munoz is getting hit a little bit more and he's kind of starting. It seems to you're starting to see the effects on the strikes. Like you're seeing him starting to not necessarily get hurt, but get stunned. Um, yeah, they, they they seem to be taking an effect. And and typically with the style that Munoz has, at some point that's gonna happen. I don't think like the normal stuff from some from Zahabi could finish Munoz, but I think the flashy stuff that Zahabi sometimes throws, that's the stuff that could finish Pedro Munoz. Now that really sucks because again, I really like Pedro Munoz. I, I think he's much better than people give him credit for, for sure. But like I said, if you look at this, you know, strikes landed per minute, 3.43 3 to 5.32, Munoz. Accuracy is 43 to 43, even. Absorbed 3.61 to 6.23. Defense is 71 to 56. Now, he does go for takedowns, but he's only 18% accuracy with it. He does have good takedown defense, but so does Zahavi. Doesn't really go for submissions. And uh, um, Zahabi is on a four-fight win streak. Just beat Javid Basharat, which I didn't think he won that fight, but it was close enough to where, all right, sure, I guess, you know. Um, yeah, Munoz is just getting hit so much. Like this loss right here. Keller Phillips, 114. Did have a takedown. Munoz did have a takedown, but still. Marlon Vera, 141. Sean O'Malley, that was a weird one. Dominic Cruz, 103. Jose Aldo, 114. Uh, the Pedro Munoz outstruck Frankie Edgar 166 to 135, but okay. Sterling 174 to 105. His losses, he's always outstruck. And I just think this fight, Zahabi's going to have a little bit more pop on his strikes, and that's the difference in this matchup. As always, guys, subscribe, like, comment, let me know you're picking. Peace.